game today comes to you from the Emerald City, Seattle, Washington. Well, the first week is in the books. Thanks for being here again today in week two. And we're just about ready to get this game started as the visiting team square off against the Seahawks. They're lined up for the kickoff. So let's get this game started. Haley is just about ready to kick this one away. This one is handled by Paris. We're ready to go on offense for the first time. First and ten. Only one man back. And off to the tailback. Butler comes up to make the play at the 21. He has a fast first step. He can explode through the hole, but he needs a line to create that little crease or cutback lane to break free. Second and ten. Ball on the 21 yard line. Only one man in the backfield. They'll spot this one at the 25-yard line. This is a spot where you want to show the defense that they have to respect the running game. And he picks up about four. Now it's third and six coming up. Knight, the long setback, makes the handle. Throws it incomplete pass. They did a nice job up front with their bull rushes and rips and stunts, forcing adjustments along the offensive line. They have to do a better job getting off the ball and controlling the line of scrimmage. But they're going to have a tough time whenever they drop back to throw. Number 89 sets up to run back the punt. Fair catch. First and ten. Ball on the 33-yard line. Hey, here we go. Defense is out of the eye formation. They'll go with a play fake with the pass. Swings it out to the left. McPherson is there on the stop. No gain. Ball on their own 33. Ball on the 33-yard line. Go low! Go low! The visiting team with a four-man front. He gets the carry. Lloyd comes up to make the play at the 45-yard line. Barnes pushing his way through the would-be tackler as he picks up solid yardage. The visiting team come out in a 4 3. No more, fella. Going to the air on first down. With the pass, he hits his receiver. Number 84 makes the catch, but doesn't get very far. And that's what the mark of a solid defense is. They close in on you in a hurry, and they don't miss tackle. Ball right around midfield. Ball on the 48 yard line. All right, let's go. Keep moving. The visiting team line up at a 4-3. Steps up into the pocket, looking for the long completion. Knocked away. The defense was coming after him on that play. He knew he didn't have much time, and he decided to get rid of the ball quickly on that one. The visiting team come out in a 4-3. And off to the tailback. Ford is there for the tackle at the 40. And that game will get them a fresh set of downs. It was a great run. You saw his blockers create some room for him. 
And the accelerator right through the hole. So they have first and ten here. Let's go now. The visiting team line up in a 4-3. With a counterplay. They're going to spot this one at the 34-yard line. This is one of those games where you just keep running it at them. Four yards here, five yards there, and loosen them up, and then wham. You knock them out late in the game with that long touchdown run. Gain of six on the play. The Seahawks line up in trips bunch. Molden is there on the stop at the 32-yard line. Number 34 runs off tackle for a gain of a couple. On the third down, they have to get it to the 30 for a first. Check it. It's showtime, baby. Check it out, baby. Go make the play. Hand it off. Johnson brings him down before he can reach the marker. So after failing on third down, let's see if they decide to try a long field goal. Give his team the lead for this field goal attempt. The veteran connecting for the field goal. He's one of those guys who really works hard at what he does. And you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one. They'll set up for the return. From the eight. They forced a three and out on the last series. So they have first and ten here. It's important to pound the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they're going to bend. Gain of four. Ball on their own 28. Ball on the 28-yard line. The Seahawks come out in a nickel package. Gets rid of it. Paris was the intended receiver on that play. Defense mixes up their zone. What you want to do is look to the middle of the field or the seam right between the corner and the safety for completion. So three and out, and they'll line up to punt. From the 41 yard line. Number 89. Doesn't have a whole lot of room to work with getting it to the 50 yard line. Ball at about midfield. Start the drive at the 50 yard line. First and 10. Barnes lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Let's go, boys! in this direction. But is there for the tackle at midfield. No gain on that play as the linebacker slipped in almost unnoticed. Yeah, he did a great job getting in there. He was looking for the run before they even snapped the ball. 
Ball at midfield. Hey, let's go. Only one man back. Matt sends a man in motion. From the start, from the start. One of us will make a play. Crosses it right. Molden is there on the stop at the 48 yard line. He likes to run in behind his blockers and then make a cut off their hip for a big game. But that strategy didn't work here. Third and 12. Ball of 48 yards. Here go. The rush is on. Gets rid of it. And he makes the grab. The 40. Johnson is there for the tackle at the 35-yard line. Johnny has great touch. Now you say, what's his strength? What does he do best? Well, you can see it right there. It's his accuracy that puts this guy on a whole nother level. Ball on the 35-yard line. Nothing. They don't get nothing. The visiting team come out on a nickel pack. This one will be spotted at the 24-yard line. And that tackle gives him three in the game. Great run there. That'll be a first down. He really ran well there. He gets some great blocks, and he has patience as he picks up the first down. First and ten. Pressure coming. Gets the pass off. The wide receiver has it. Max will add only about one yard to his numbers with that completion. Second and ten. Ball of a 24 yard. They ain't got nothing. Come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. The visiting team come out with eight guys in the box. This pass is incomplete. Sometimes you see a quarterback purposely underthrow a receiver. So the defensive back overruns it. I don't think that was the case there. Lewis was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Third and ten. Ball of the 24 yard line. Come on! Drops back. With the pass. Barnes was his intended target. Heads out onto the field for the field goal attempt. The veteran kicks it through. You give credit to the kicker there. It's nice to have a guy that can make your drive worth three, even if you don't get in in the end zone every time. From the nine. So the offense takes over. The last time they had the ball, they had a very tough time getting anything going. Ball on their own 31. They line up in the I formation. They tried to jump the snap count. <laughs> so he's called for encroachment. Yeah, he jumped early and touched an offensive player, and that forces the officials to blow the whistle. First and five after the penalty. Let's go. This is the Seahawks line up in a 4 3. Move in, move in. Toss to the left. Butler is there on the stop at the 34. Nothing doing that time, John, as the linebacker gets there quickly. He's one of those guys who's a sure tackle. He'll move up and play physically at the line, come on a blitz, and play the run just about as well as anyone on the defense. Knight, the lone setback. Watch the man in motion. With the counterplay, flips the tackle. 
Butler is there for the tackle at the 31. That one started off poorly and only got worse. That defensive line did a better job than the offensive line, and that's how they were able to get penetration to stop that play in the backfield. Third and 10. Ball on the 31 yard line. The Seahawks come out in a nickel pack. Keep the throttle down. The rush is on. Steps up into the pocket. He can't get away. And this is the type of team that likes to blitz to create pressure. They'll call the cover two or cover three on passing downs a lot of times, but they also like to bring extra guys on blitzes trying to mix it up. Comes into the game for the punt. Number 89 into return. Won't take a chance trying to return this one. Ball on their own 29. The visiting team come out in a nickel package. Going to the air on first down. Uses the pump. Long throw. He was tipped. The coaching staff thinks that he has some of the best hands in the team. And it's surprising to see him drop a pass like that. there for the tackle at the 36. Now let's have a look at what our runners have done up to this point. Third and two coming up here. The visiting team come out in a nickel package. On the carry. Nice play fake. Throws it. Leap to the wide receiver. Little is the guy who's there to bring him down at the 45-yard line. Run! Run! Let's go, B. Let's go. direction. McPherson stops him for negative yardage. Great penetration there. And that's the thing. To stop any kind of run between the tackles, you have to get some sort of penetration. You have to get into the backfield, and when you do that, you make the back change direction, making him go where he doesn't want to go. After one quarter of play, the score is 6-0. Seahawks. Seahawks. Six. The away team. And we're ready to start the second quarter. Ball on their own 44. Ball on the 44 yard line. Here I go. Let's run, Mizzet. With a counter play. Nice move. Molden comes up to make the play at the 47. Holding on the offense. Number six, Eden. The call is holding and that'll push them back. That's what happens when your feet and your body get going in the wrong position. So we'll have a second and long after the penalty. The visiting team with a four-man front. Setting up play action. Going deep. He made the catch. This one will be spotted at the 24-yard line. It's the fourth stop he's made today. He brings it in for a big game. Almost every wide receiver gets better at running routes as they get older. And this guy's no exception. Hey. 
Ball on the 24-yard line. The visiting team come out in a nickel package. Going to the air on first down with the pass. And it's caught. Little is there for the tackle at the 12. John has proven he's a consistent target. Yeah, especially in situations where they're looking to get first down yardage. They're 12 yards away from the end zone. On the 12 -yard line. Right, the man in motion. It's the toss to the left. Wiley is there on the stop at the four-yard line. I tell you, when you're talking about a guy who's a feature back, this is the kind of guy you're talking about. And this is the eighth play of this drive inside the five. The visiting team come out of the 46. Can he get there? Nice play for pressure. The defense likes to keep the pressure on. They'll bring extra guys on an overloaded side, hoping for turnover opportunity. They need 10 for the touchdown. On the 10 yard line. The visiting team come out in a dime package. Goes to the end zone. Touchdown, Seahawks. This is a good play by the offense in the red zone. The wide receiver is going to break away right here and come up with a catch and the touchdown. The point after is good. Excellent possession there, John, capped off by the touchdown. And right now they've given themselves a little room for error. They're moving the ball out there pretty easily. Every time I see these guys play, I'm very impressed by the players they have, especially on offense. But the thing that impresses me most is the coaching staff. They're always very well prepared. They do a good job of calling plays and the plays that are designed to take advantage of the other team's weaknesses. Haley in to kick this one off. Nice kick. Plenty of distance. From the four-yard line. Following upon the last drive, the offense now makes its way back out onto the field. The Seahawks come out in a nickel package. Hand off to the tailback. Thompson comes up to make the play. Running the ball consistently is a first step in creating a balanced attack. It's second down and four to go. Let's go, Only one man back. Drops back. Rowing. He was tipped. He felt the pressure and got rid of the ball. That's what the defense has been talking about. Make this guy throw it before he's ready. It's just that little split second early that can cause an incomplete pass or even an interception. Third and four. Ball on the 27-yard line. The Seahawks line up in a 4-3. Throwing short. Fumble. The visiting team. Get it. The ball was loose in the backfield, but the offense is able to jump on it first. Oh, got lucky that time. That's a real heads-up play. Perry will come in now to punt it away. Number 89. Looks like he's ready for the return. Huh? 
And so the punt goes out of bounds. Ball on the 41 yard line. The visiting team with a four man front. He gets the carry. Great fake with the throw. Ward stops him at the 30. So the whole field was able to stay back there and find the open man. You know, when a defense is sending extra rushers at the quarterback, it takes a lot of poise to get the ball out of there with any accuracy. Ball on the 30 yard line. Ball on the 30 yard line. Barnes, the lone back. They give it to the halfback. Molden is the guy who's there to bring him down at the 26-yard line. You have a good balance of run and pass on offense. The defense doesn't have a chance to focus in on either one of them. They need to be prepared to cover both options. Pickup of about five. Ball on the 26-yard line. Only one man back. Off to the tailback. Johnson comes up to make the play at the 16 yard line. He blitz in the back foot. Yeah, that's a chance you take. You're hoping to get some penetration and hit him in the backfield. But if you miss, there isn't a lot of help at the next level to keep him from picking up the first down. Ball on the 16 yard line. So, with the ball in the red zone, they have a very good chance of extending that lead. To carry it. Wow. Is there for the tackle. Barnes runs it through the middle of the game of about six. They need 11 yards to get it into the end zone. The Seahawks come out with three receivers tight. Gets rid of it, and it's caught. We're going to spot this one at the six. And that's now three tackles for him in this game. The Seahawks are having success on first and second down on this drive and haven't faced a third down situation yet. It's first and goal at the six-yard line. He gets the carry. Great fake with the throw. Comes down with it. Touchdown, Seattle. He gets a great block right here to spring him for the touchdown. I'll tell you, he takes a defender right out of his shoes that time. point attempt is good. They were set up with good field position and were able to make the most of it by getting the touchdown. It's never a good thing for your defense when they come out onto the field and they start in their own territory. They couldn't get the job done there. Haley comes in to kick off. Booming kick downfield. From the five. The visiting team face an uphill battle as they begin this drive at the 23. The visiting team line up in a five receiver set this time. Gets rid of it. And this pass is complete. A successful offense is one that can run and throw for good yardage on first down.
Ball on their own 33. Ball on the 33-yard line. The Seahawks line up in the quarter defense. And he hits his target. Great throw to beat the zone. I'll tell you, the defense has to do a better job of coming up and clamping down on the receiver whenever he enters their zone. First, First and ten. Ball on the 42-yard line. Barnett gains the defense from the gun. Pumps once with the pass. He finds his man, and he steps out of bounds at the 44. So they get two first downs on their last two plays. And they're getting it done by seeing the whole field and taking what the defense gives them. Ball on the 44-yard line. Ball on the 44-yard line. The Seahawks come out in a 4-3. And off to the back. Mark is there for the tackle at the 38-yard line. So let's take a look at how this back compares to the opposition. Almost at the two-minute mark now. Launches it across the middle. Incomplete. He deflected it just in time to avert the completion. Two-minute warning coming up. Knight, the lone back, number 85, goes in motion. Under pressure, puts everything behind this one. Almost picked off. That was a good play, turned bad play. Good because their zone defense worked well. Bad because he dropped the interception. That's one he wishes he could have back. Harry is ready to pump this one away. Number 89, back to return. He signals for a fair catch. Almost at the two-minute mark now. The visiting team line up in a 4-3. Growing. He goes up and ramps it. Yeah, that's a tough catch to make. First, you got to get your hands in the ball. Then you got to try and protect yourself from getting knocked out by the defender. Ball on their own 26. Ball on the 26-yard line. The visiting team come out in a nickel package. Gets rid of it. He hits his receiver. You're going to spot this one at the 36. So that tackle now gives him four. Johnny has such a quick release, and the ball is out before anybody knows what's happening. And that makes it hard for him to be sacked, and it gives the defenders less time to react. First and ten. Ball on the 36 yard line. From the start, from the start. It's time, The visiting team line up in a 4-3. With the pass, incomplete. Jensen was the intended receiver on that play. The intended receiver on the play. Second and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. Hey, let's go. They'll go from the shotgun. Tucks it away. Setting up play action. Closing in. Rowing. And he hits his target. Wiley makes the tackle at the 43-yard line. Number 84. Looks to be shaken up after that play, and we'll get you a report from the sideline when we get the information. Third and four. Ball on the 43-yard line. Let's go, beat you. Get it, get it, get it. Nice job so far on third down for the offense, and we'll see if that continues here. Conservative play call there as they stay on the ground but come up well short due to a fine stop by the defensive end. A 
number five, comes into the game for the punt. Parrish is the deep return man. And he signals for the fair catch. Fair catch made at the 22-yard line. They'll First take and over ten at the 22-yard line. First and ten. Barnett will work out of the shotgun. Gets rid of it. Incomplete. Mason was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Intended receiver on the play. Second and ten. Ball on the 22-yard line. The Seahawks with a four-man front. With the pass. Nearly intercepted. Number 85. Was his intended target. Martin was there on the cover. Third and long. Let's see what play they choose to keep this drive going. Third and ten. Ball on the 22-yard line. Watch it! The Seahawks come out in a nickel package. Pressure coming. The rush gets to him from behind. I really like the way these guys play defense. They're aggressive and their intensity leads to big time plays like that. Defense did a great job on that series, pushing them backward. Fair catch. Fair catch made at the 46 yard line. The ball on their own 46. Will start the drive at the 46 yard line. First and 10. This side, this side. Pressure. This one falls incomplete. Creating pressure can really change the way an offense operates. They need to keep some extra blockers in, either a tight end on the line or a back that can help them out with their protection. Second and ten. Ball on the 46 yard line. The Seahawks line up in a five receiver set this time. Throws it. It's broken up. He's got great recovery speed. He can catch up to the ball even if he's caught out of position. That time he was right there in the secondary to tip the ball away. Jones was the intended receiver on that play. Third and ten. Ball on the 46 yard line. Matt looking to pass. Lines up with five wide receivers. Gets rid of it. Ooh, nearly picked off. When you talk about ball control and time of possession, that's not what you want to see. Number five will come in now to punt it away. Parrish lines up deep for the punt return. Won't take a chance trying to return this one. Number 84 it was taken out earlier with a minor hey, the injury, screen. but now returns to the game. The Seahawks line up at a 4 3. Gives it off to the back, but comes up to make the play. And now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running threat has been today. Ball on their own 15. Ball on the 15 yard line. Knight is the deep back. Is 
is there on the stop. Right now, they need to keep going at the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they'll be able to break one for a big game. One yard gain on that play. At the end of two, the score is 20 to nothing. Seahawks. The away team. Perry is back and ready to put this one in the air. Good kick should be returnable. This one is taken by number 89. The most important thing to do now is to protect the football. You've got a good lead, and you don't want to throw it away by making any costly mistakes. Ball on their own 21. They'll go from the I formation. Uses the pump. This one falls incomplete. He decided to try and pass it, but he was taking so much heat that it just kind of wobbled out of there. Second and ten. Ball on the 21-yard line. Barnes, the lone back. On the ground. Nice play for Long throw. He's got it. And he's planted in the open field by Little. He did his job, found the single coverage, and delivers a perfect pass. Ball on the 39-yard line. Ball on the 39-yard line. Barnes in the backfield. Hand it off. Lloyd is there for the tackle at the 40s. When you get penetration like that, it's very hard for the offense to get positive yardage. Second and 11. Ball on the 40-yard line. Lewis in motion. And off to the tailback. McPherson is there on the stop at the 37. So after that run, we can see how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. On third down, they have to get it to the 29-yard line for a first down. Here we go, baby. With the pass, jumps up, he has it. Molden brings him down before he can reach the marker. Jensen can't get past the marker, so it'll bring up fourth down. Sent that one right through his third of the game. So the field goal caps off the first drive of the second half. And this is just the way you want to come out in the third quarter. from the five-yard line. The visiting team need to rebound quickly as they start this drive at the 22-yard line. Ball on their own 22. From the start, from the start. Knight, the lone back. Hand off to the tailback. Dig is there for the tackle at the 30. You've got to keep going to the run. You never know when there's going to be great blocking ahead of you, allowing for a big one right into the end zone. Second and maybe three. Ball on the 30-yard line. 
Barnett from the shotgun. Drops back. Rolling out to his right. Looking deep to the right. He made the count. Nice, nice ball going ball. to the air. That That'll move the chase. In a first down. Ball on the 39-yard line. Ball on the 39-yard line. Hold the look. Here you go, baby. The Seahawks line up in a 4-3. Hands it off to the back. Whoa, he's there on the stop. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. But there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. You got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the opening. Four-yard gain on the play. Ball on the 35-yard line. Barnett starts out with a shotgun. With the pass, Harris is there for the tackle. They get first down yardage on that hookup. The Seahawks come out in a 4-3. Under pressure. And here's the thing. Now the defense gets into the backfield. But you got to be able to move your feet, avoid the rush, to give yourself a little more time. He just didn't do it. Now in second and long after the set. 32 yard line. Gets rid of it. It's on the ground. The visiting team scoop it up. And you know the defense is very angry at that missed opportunity. The 17-yard line is where they have to go for a first. The Seahawks come out on a nickel packet with the throw. And he's forced out of bounds at the 21-yard line. Randall can't get past the marker, so it'll bring up fourth down. Randall lines up for the field goal to try to put them on the board for the first time in the game. The is good. Well, the key to winning is having your drives get some sort of points for your team. They got it done on that drive. I'm sure they'll think a touchdown for their next one. Perry is just about ready to kick this one away. They'll return this one. From the seven. If they keep playing like they did in the first half, you can chalk up another win for this franchise. The Seahawks will start the drive at the 34 yard line. First and 10. Barnes, the lone back. Gets rid of it. He hits his receiver. Little comes up to make the play at the 42-yard line. Took what he was given, completing the pass. Yeah, what you want to do as a receiver who's facing zone coverage is to break into the secondary, find a hole, settle down, and show the quarterback your numbers. That was a good job. The visiting team come out in a 4-3. Burnside is there for the tackles. Ball on their own 45. Yeah, you see him. Hand it off to the back. This one will be 
was spotted at the 48-yard line. The tackle is his fifth of the game. He was looking for a place to run, but all those places were filled up with guys waiting to tackle him. So a pickup of maybe three. It's second down and seven to go. the tailback and he just got level Barnes has gained enough for another first down his second of the drive ball on the 42 yard line the visiting team come out in a 4-3 Lloyd is there for the tackle at the 41-yard line. This team's always trying to get a good mix of run and pass plays. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 41-yard line. Come on! The Seahawks line up in trips bunch. Hand off to the tailback. Sharp stiff. One is there on the stop at the 33. A solid running game starts with a blocking of the offensive line. But the ball carrier must have good vision so he can take advantage of the holes that they open up. Third down play upcoming to convert. They have to get it to the 32. that time this is tough running here let's watch him as he gets through right here and he breaks a tackle and keeps moving forward I'll tell you this guy's hard to bring down held their positions and didn't let them get very far. And this is the ninth play of this drive. Number 34 in the backfield. We're going to spot this one at the 22-yard line. That's his third tackle of the contest. Gain of a handful. Third down and four coming up on this one. They've executed very well on third down so far, and that's a big reason why they're ahead at the moment. So a fly to the end zone. Drops the interception. And because of that drop would be interception, they can still kick the field goal. You can't miss chances like that to steal points away. Make a good kick here. The, the try is good. Each play you run on offense tires out the defense a little more. When you can put together that many plays in a row, it gets you into scoring position. This time, it got them three. From the six yard line. The visiting team have their work cut out for them as they take over at the 19. They'll take over at the 19 yard line. First and 10. The Seahawks line up in a 4 3. Here we go, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go. 
receives the handoff. Butler comes up to make the play at the 18-yard line. These plays can end up with lost yards if the defense gets through or around their blocking quickly enough. Ball on their own 18. Ball on the 18-yard line. With the pass, almost intercepted. Harris was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Harris with the coverage. Third and 11. Ball on the 18 yard line. I think this defense looks forward to these third down situations because they've been stopping them today. Closing in, throws it, breaks the tackle. Phillips comes up to make the play at the 33. Nothing new that time as they go to the air again using the same play and pick up a first down. First and 10. Ball on the 33 yard line. The Seahawks line up in a 4 3. Going to the right. Mark is there on the stop at the 34. Knight runs off tackle for a gain of a couple. Second and eight coming up here. So we've reached the end of the third quarter with the Seahawks ahead of the visiting team. 26-3. And we'll start the fourth quarter. Fall on their own 34. Watch out. Everything you've got. Hey, watch the screen. Drops back. Pump face with the throw. Butler is the guy who's there to bring him down. Perfect execution to get this first down. Look at it here. He knows how far they have to move the chain. And he gets it by making the right decision and laying it in there like that. Second and ten. The Seahawks line up in a 4-3. Mitchell is there for the tackle at the 46. They get some decent yardage on the run, but John, they're using up precious seconds. What they really need to do is put the ball in the air. Put the pressure on the secondary. Eighth play of this drive. This team has to start converting on third down if they're going to be successful. Throws it. Knocked down. Phillips had the coverage on the play. They're in a tough spot here, but they have to go for it. Pressure coming. Going deep. It's caught. Clinton comes up to make the play at the seven-yard line. Watch how they get it done when the pressure's on. It's fourth down. They just call a great play. And he puts the ball right where it needs to be to pick up that first down. Considering the size of the deficit. Yeah, this is a time to put the ball in the air and force the defense to defend the long pass. Just four yards from the goal line now. Let's go. And the fans finally. 
finally get to see their red zone offense. Carroll is there on the stop at the three. Play calling is very surprising considering the size of the deficit. This is not a good time to sneak in a running play. They need lots of yards real fast. It's third and goal at the three-yard line. The offense has had trouble moving the sticks on third down so far. Touchdown, visiting team. And he powers his way in there. He follows that push and he gets the score. It appears the coach wants to go for two. Hey, let's go. From the start, from the start. Watch the hard count. Watch the snap down. Pump fakes with the pass. Almost picked off. They failed to get the two. Comes in to kick off. From the nine. They have this game pretty well in hand. This is one of those spots where you might want to get some of your backups some playing time. So they have first and ten here. The visiting team come out in a 4-3. Great man gets in there for a big sack. He's got a great combination of size and move. Now, he won't be winning any races, but he's good at getting after the quarterback. And let me tell you, you never want him to be the guy falling on top of you. Now it's second and long after the set. 29-yard line. They come out in a dime package. Rowan, right on target to the wide receiver. Rowan didn't have much room to do anything with that one. Yeah, they had the coverage, and they made the sure play instead of trying something fancy, like going for the pick. It's third down and seven to go. The visiting team come out on a nickel package. It's the toss to the left. Pearson stops him short of the marker. They played it safe, stayed on the ground, nothing doing. Right. Number five is ready to pump this one away. Parrott sets up, waiting for the punt. And he chooses not to return this one. First and ten. They line up in the I formation. Good play in the backfield by Butler. He's had a tough day out there so far. The Seahawks come out in a 4-3. Pressure throws this one away. He didn't want to risk an interception and decides to throw it away. Ball on their own 15. Under pressure, throwing. Nearly intercepted. Harris was his intended target. Harris was there on the cover. It's 
of the lineup to punt after going three and out. From the 45 yard line, number 89 takes the punt to the 35 yard line. Ball on the 35 yard line. The visiting team with a four man front. I'll give it to the halfback. Johnson is there for the tackle at the 35. Lawrence, handoff on the delay, brings it ahead for about a yard. Ball on the 35 yard line. Ball on the 35 yard line. All right, let's go. Matt will work out of the shotgun. Good to throw. Just couldn't get that pass under control. There's not one wide receiver who can ever play him. He's never dropped a pass. It's just part of the game. Here are the numbers when it comes to third down conversions. Off. Brady takes him down before he can get the first. Fourth down upcoming, but they're in position to add to their lead. Yeah, and that's what they wanted to do. Control the ball and the clock. Or getting into position to add at least three points. Hey, and the kicking team come on for this field goal attempt. The kick seasons through. It's good. They're up by 20 now following the field goal. should have a return from the six yard line they need one quick score and then some more Seahawks with a four-man front. They'll give it to the halfback. They'll go with the play fake. And the catch is made. Number 85 picks up about four yards on that reception. Second and six coming up here. The Seahawks come out in a nickel pack. Throws it. This one falls incomplete. And this guy is so strong, he was able to get that pass away. Third and six. Ball on the 26 yard line. The Seahawks come out in a nickel pack. Gets the pass off. But the hammers him at the 30 yard line. Mason doesn't get enough to convert, and that brings up fourth down. Perry comes into the game for the punt. Number 89 sets up to run back the punt. And so the punt goes out of bounds. First and ten. 
Ball on the 42 yard line. Let us get to the carry it. But is there on the stop at the 45 yard line. Barnes takes advantage of a little daylight, picks up three yards. Ball on their own 45. Ball on the 45 yard line. He gets the carry. Look at that power. Wilder comes up to make the play. Some of these guys are like a train. Lower their head, keep their legs moving, and charge the straight ahead. Sometimes he'll even drag a defender 10 yards before he'll start slowing down. First, First and 10. Ball on the 43 yard line. Let's go, let's go. Come on. The visiting team come out with eight guys in the box. To the tailback. Ward is there on the stop. Good play by the linebacker to get into the backfield and stop the play for no gain. I'll tell you, that comes from watching a lot of film and knowing the tendencies of the opponent. That was a heck of a play. Almost at the two minute mark now. Hey, let's go one deep. Hold the left. Where the counter play keeps his feet moving. The 30. They're going to spot this one at the 24. He records his third tackle of the game. This is a great block. Watch here. He just barrels into the defender, taking him right off the turf. Now that is a textbook block right there. First Two minutes ten. left. Ball on the 24-yard line. Watch your eyes. Get it up. Nickelback in this time. Hand it off to the back. Slips the tackle. Burnside is there for the tackle at the 16-yard line. Number 34. Running hard, going right through the arm tackles. Down inside the 15. Ball on the 16-yard line. there on the stop. The Seahawks are handling the defense right now. They haven't even had a third down in this drive. First Ball on the 13-yard line. Ball on the 13-yard line. The visiting team come out in a 4-3. Hands it off to the back. Pearson is there for the tackle at the six. He's one of those guys that can put up 100 yards week in and week out. This has been just another day at the office for him. Six yards to go for a touchdown. The visiting team with a four-man front. Burnside comes up to make the play. Number 34 takes advantage of a little daylight, picks up three yards. Four more yards to finish off the drive for the touchdown. Let's turn it up, D. Regular, regular, regular. Oh, no, Sean. Check it. Hand it off. Brady makes the tackle, but it's beyond the marker, so they pick up a first down. Great job on the ground, picking up first down yardage, their third first down of the series. They're just a yard away now. for the goal line. Puts it on the ground. The visiting team. Pick it up. The defender with room to run. Touchdown. Visiting team. They come up with a big fourth quarter takeaway and put some points on the board.
Reynolds comes in to attempt the point after. The extra point attempt is good. The visiting team have just made it a two-score game. This team can put up some points, but this might be a little too deep a hole. As we take a look at his success returning kicks, we get ready for the kickoff. is back and ready to put this one in the air. From the eight. So this could be the last play of the game. First and ten. Well, that game off. Johnson is there for the tackle at the 35 yard line. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 35 yard line. Good evening. 